So iOS 16 developer beta 3 is almost here. So this is a quick preview of all the expected features and the release date of developer beta 3. Now before getting into beta 3, I also want to give you a quick overview of the second developer version which we got last week and it's been very very buggy for me especially the widgets on the lock screen and specifically the world clock one which for some reason just keeps confusing the AM and PM of many cities and that kind of defeats the purpose of having a world clock in the first place so hopefully they address this bug with the third beta but other than that it's the battery life which is it's been bad for me to be honest and even the battery health was on 89% in beta 1 and it's dropped by 1% to 88 in beta 2 which is a bit concerning to be honest it's depreciating very very quickly so hopefully they address that with the next developer version but apart from that it's, it's been pretty amazing it's been stable than beta 1 so hopefully they will carry this momentum into developer beta 3 and i hope they also fix the timer bug where the timer just stops showing you the time on the lock screen which again defeats the purpose of having a timer so hopefully they fix that and address that with beta 3 but apart from that there are a few things you can expect from beta 3 one of them being a bit of a revamp of the music player in the lock screen so first off i think apple will introduce the cover art expansion so where you tap on the cover art on the music player it basically expands and takes all of your lock screen hopefully that'll be introduced with beta 3 and i do hope they fix the music player itself on the lock screen because it's way too hard to scribble and scroll through this and pinpoint to an exact timestamp so hopefully they fix that and i hope they also add the audio levels on the music player which is supposed to be there it used to be in ios 15 it's not there anymore and makes it way harder for me and i'm pretty sure everyone because you have to go to the control center to see your volume levels so hopefully they add that and I do hope they basically make it a little more easier with the lock screen situation. And what I've heard is that they might introduce the old wallpapers as well. So the ones you used to have in iOS 15, they will make a section at the bottom to reintroduce those old wallpapers just because they used to be there. But apart from that, I'm pretty sure Apple will address all the bugs I have mentioned and maybe a few more that I missed. But yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Now, when can we expect Beta 3 from Apple? So the release cycle has been a little weird this year. Developer Beta 2 came out on a Thursday and usually all the developer versions they come out on Tuesday on a two week cycle from the initial release. So if you continue on that, the expected release date should be the 5th of July along with the public beta. So we'll get Beta 3 and public beta together on the same date. So technically it's supposed to be the 5th which is next Tuesday. But Apple, again, being on their weird release cycle, it can be any day throughout that week. But my money is on the 5th of July. So yeah, that is pretty much it. And I hope you all enjoyed the video. And if you did, give it a big thumbs up. And as always, thank you all for watching and stay tuned for more. Until then, please like, comment and subscribe. Peace.